Mendeley's monohybrid cross. As pear plants produce seeds only by self-pollination, he observed that tall plants produced always tall plants generation after generation under natural conditions, as shown here. Tall pea plants reproduced through self-pollination. Here you can see all charred plants are tall. Similarly, dwarf plants produced always dwarf plants generation after generation through self-pollination. Hence, Gregor Mendel termed the tall and dwarf plants as wild type or pure breeding varieties. Then he closed a tall plant with a dwarf plant, produced progeny, and calculated the percentage of tallness and dwarfness in subsequent generations. When a pure breeding tall plant was crossed with a pure breeding dwarf plant, all plants were tall in the first filial generation. There was not any medium height plants or dwarf plants. This means that on one of the parental traits, tallness, were seen and not the mixture of the two. When such a F1 tall plant was allowed to have self pollination, both the tall and dwarf plants appeared in second fear generation, called F2, in the ratio of 3 to 1. This indicates that both tallness and dwarfness were inherited in the F1 plants, but only tallness trait was expressed. The first experiment of Mendel considering the inheritance of a single trait, height of the plant, tall or dwarf, is called monohybrid cross. Expression of morphological character as tall or dwarf plant Violet or white flower is called phenotype. The expression of gene or chromosomal makeup of an individual for a particular trait is called genotype. Let's take a look at the diag diagram representation of monohybrid cross. Mendel took one tall and one dwarf pea plant for cross breeding. He found the child plants were all tall. He considered these child plants as a first filial generation plant. Then he used tall plants from first filial generation to self pollinate. He found that both tall and dwarf plants appeared in the ratio of 3 to 1. He called these plants as second filial generation plants. Gregory worked out the first ever scientific experimental study. On heredity and he was called a father of genetics. Mendel observed variations in the characteristics of garden pea plants which he had cultivated in his monastery garden. Mendel was curious to find out the results of crossing of pea plants with variations in traits. Let's study some of the visible contrasting characters that Mendel observed in his monohybrid cross. Round shape, round and wrinkled, the phenotype progeny was down seed. Seed color, yellow and green, the phenotype of progeny was yellow. Flower color, violet and white, the phenotype of progeny was violet. Pod shape, full and constricted, the phenotype of progeny was full. Pod color, green and yellow. Phenotype of progeny was green. Flower position, axial and terminal. Phenotype progeny was axial. Stem height, 
Tor and Dwarf Phenotype of Progen was Tor.